We're in Jasper County's largest town here in Newton, where health experts, residents, and even business owners are seeing COVID-19 numbers go in the wrong direction. You don't have to look hard to find signs of rising COVID-19 numbers here. Moo's Barbecue just shut down its indoor seating. It's going to be a big challenge to keep it open and keep everybody safe. Owner Jeremy Biondi and his wife are now dealing with health issues that make them immune deficient, and several staff members have spouses with COVID. So they switched to drive up and carry out service only. And if we lose even more staff, we'll probably have to be closed for a couple of weeks just to, to be safe because it's just going crazy right now. Jasper County has seen 100 cases of COVID-19 in just the past four days, mostly in the county seat of Newton, and the overall positivity rate is nearly 20%. That means the county health department is now in daily meetings with hospitals, schools, and long-term care facilities to try to deal with the rising outbreak. They encourage masks, and they're warning people that cold weather and too many people indoors and too close together could spell trouble for more hospitalizations and deaths that could be down the road. The trend we're predicting will continue to increase if people don't socially distance over the holidays, such as Thanksgiving coming up and also the Christmas holidays. Um, in the future. Biondi has stacked up all the restaurant chairs and put them on the table so there is no way to eat inside. Despite the change, he says he will survive the growing COVID crisis. He's not so sure about his fellow business owners. We're still paying our bills, but you know, the little mom and pop stores, the little boutiques, they can't, they, they won't survive with this because people are afraid to go inside. Jasper County schools are doing a mix of hybrid and in-person learning, but that could change if the COVID-19